Hello again. Um, this is going to be a quick description uh, and I guess tutorial on how to utilize the height map starter pack variety project on my fab store uh, that contains a lot of well not a lot but a few preset levels so that you might be able to skip the import process for height maps and levels in Unreal Engine 5.5. Uh, there's a few issues I've seen with people who have purchased the pack uh, with regards to getting the latest version which includes the 100 kilometer content. So I thought I would basically upload a additional version to make sure that there are uh, other ways of getting the updated version because fab do not seem to uh, add the latest version to the main download and I have resubmitted it multiple times but people seem to still only get version 1 so I'm going to show you uh, a way of getting that as well as just general use uh, use cases of the project so obviously usually you would go to this button and download the project and it would all work normally um, there is also the option of doing it through the epics games launcher but that seems to be probably where the main problems are so I have added at the bottom this additional file um, and this one will always 100% have the v, uh, version 2 or v2 version of the project so you should be able to get it um, from that so if we hit download we are basically given the multiple options uh, the standard one is uh, through the epics games launcher as it says here and then you also have the additional files version and it will show you here v2 zip and we can go ahead and hit download there so while that downloads I'm going to quickly describe what is in the actual pack and essentially what we have is as it's described we have the standalone height map files which I will go through once the project is downloaded and opened um, we have that for the original uh, height maps which are also available for free in the video descriptions if we was to go to my YouTube channel and we go down to playlists we have this height map tutorial series here this is uh, all videos surrounding height maps um, apologies for that sound uh, so we have all the videos here or you can click onto the playlist itself and get them all of these ones with the free height map um, in the title essentially have the link to these height maps so if I was just to click on any one of these we'll just go for this one <laughs> I'm trying to hit that pause button um, yeah and then we go down to the description we have the fab marketplace link and the free download link as well as the ability to jump into the discord if you hit this free download link it will take you to the four height maps the 1k 2k 4k and 8k maps that you can find in the videos um, and you can basically download those for free and install them or import them yourself which I will not go through now because that's what these videos describe so there is the free versions <coughs> we then have um, the option of purchasing the the pack and this will basically bypass the need for you to import and have the issues that come with importing large height maps and it comes with these levels already preset up with uh, well petition landscape regions and other you know everything basically done ready for you to start sculpting 
painting, adding trees, everything like that. Um, so that is basically what the project is. It's nothing more than that. It is just a kind of starting point for projects and I will be adding more and more and more uh, landscapes to this map project. Um, so now that that is covered and we know what to expect, uh, we're now going to jump into the project which I've just downloaded. So once you've downloaded it you should be greeted with a zip file um, called Mozart height maps underscore v2. As long as it's got that v2 you know it's the the most updated one. Um, obviously the next one will be v3, v4, etc. So we right click and we extract which basically extracts the files from the zip and that will take however long that takes. Um, so you have to have a as a program for unzipping 7-zip or zip2 or whatever those things are called and basically it's quite a big project even though it's simple it's 1.3 gigs so it will take um, a fair bit of time to un pack. Okay, so we've got our unpacked height map, which you can click into, and this is essentially the project, which you can then double click to open. So, once the project opens, you should be greeted with the 2K map, as you can see here. Um, it should be open. If it isn't open, then all you'd have to do would be to come to your World Petition panel, zoom out potentially, and you would select these regions and then you would right click and hit load selected regions. That is the same for every level. And um, that's just how World Petition works. If you don't have this window, then it would be up into the window World Petition uh, World Petition Editor and that will open up this tab for you and that is basically how you get to open the map and get into it and uh, begin doing whatever you need to do just to check that the project is definitely the latest you would come into your content browser open the levels folder and as long as you see both the 100 kilometer folder and the height map files you know that you are good to go so essentially the levels folder is the parent folder which has the original content as you can see here these are all the levels um, from the free height maps all preset for you two versions of the 1k one version of the two a version of the 4 and a version of the 8k with all of their HLOD layers ready to go. We then have the 100 kilometer by 100 kilometer uh, fo uh, folder and in there we have the level for the mountain and the volcano levels all preset. Within this folder we have the same levels with no edit layers uh, if you want those um, they might run a little bit better it's just all up to you to test and see which one works best for you and which one runs good once you start applying materials and such um, so that is the levels also within that we have a height map files folder and this contains those three height maps uh, inside the project as well as the 100k uh, variations which are only available in here and essentially we have the um, what am I trying to say we have 1k 2k 4k versions of both the mountains and the volcano um, height maps which you can basically use to re-import and try different resolutions and you know it just depends on what you need for your project whether it's high resolution photorealistic 
whether you don't want it to be 100 kilometers, you know, you can use the same terrain, but scale them however you want. Um, so in order to do that, I'm going to show you how you would actually use these height map files, um, and that works for either the original ones or these new ones. So let's just pick, let's just say one of these new ones, and I want the 2K one. So in order to export from Unreal, all you need to do is select your file, right click, and then we look for Asset Actions, which is this one here, and then we go to Export, and then we hit that. We choose our location, in this case I'm just going to choose my downloads, and then we give it a name, I'm just going to leave the name, and then we leave this as PNG, and then we hit save. Now that should already be into our downloads file uh, folder, and there it is, we can see we have our uh, 2K PNG. And now that is ready to use in other software or inside of Unreal again if you want to re-import it. Uh, I'm not going to go over the re-import process because I've got about 15 videos on it so far and you can work that out yourself, I am pretty sure, from those videos if you need to. So I hope that covers basically what this project is. Um, and everything is kind of covered in terms of questions because really you know it's quite a simple uh, project and it's here just to really give you a head start and just jump in uh, from this um, stage basically and you can just press play and you have your terrain ready to paint, put trees, add rocks, have fun. So yeah Hopefully that clears everything up, and uh, thank you very much if you have purchased the pack and supported, and uh, I appreciate it greatly, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.